Today we're playing Starcadia Quest from Come On Games and Spaghetti Western Games. I'm Mark Maya. And I'm Brittany. And I'm Jess. And this is Board Game Coffee. Get back here this instant! Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I love you too. I couldn't have done it without you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, now this is part two of our Starcadia campaign playthrough. Hey there, Mark from the future here, coming at you from the editing bay, and this episode you're about to watch was filmed before the COVID-19 lockdown, so just keep that in mind. So Jess is, we don't have her locked up in the basement, although if, if we did, we'd play a lot more three-player games, but she's not, she's at home also being safe and locked down. Other than that, enjoy the episode and stay home, stay safe. Now, we altered the rules just slightly. You see, what's supposed to happen is the characters that you start the campaign with are the characters you're supposed to continue the campaign with. But here's the thing. If you have seen part one, seeing part two again with the same characters might not interest everybody. But more than that, we don't get a chance to play games over and over again a lot of times. And we have a lot of these little characters. So in order for us to just have fun and experience more of the characters, we decided to, any character that we had in the level before, we're just gonna throw them away. Not literally, we're just gonna toss them in the box and then we're all gonna draft six other characters. So every playthrough, we'll have completely new cast of heroes. This is what I got, for example. And I'm playing with um, Alpha, and his ability is when his ally is activated, Alpha may move up to two spaces without triggering a guard reaction. And Yuri, she's got the Prime Trickster, which is when attacking with a melee weapon before choosing a target, she may move uh, one. She may move a character one space. So those are those are the characters I got this round. And who did you get? Let me see, Britt, who you got? Britt's got Robocop, also known as um, Cybot. It's, it's clearly Robocop. And he's got, he's metal plated. So when defending for each crit he rolls, he gains an additional save, which is a great card. I was hoping this card would come right back around to me so I could take that, but Brittany snagged it from me. Um, I played with him before, he's, he's great. Um, Curry, he's got regeneration. At the end of every turn, he heals one wound, which is pretty cool. Uh, you can take those. Thank you. And then Jess has got... Eh. I also played with Calvin. He's really cool. Calvin, you might also know him, know him as Marty from Back to the Future. What I like about this is Calvin was the name he used when he was in his past because his mom read it on his underwear. It's a fun little callback. I like it. Anyways, <laughs> you see he's even got the hoverboard from Back to the Future too. Anyways... His ability is back in time. Once per attack or defense, he may reroll all of his dice at once, which is a good ability. Next we, next we got Nixie here. And Nixie is, she's got Deadeye. When attacking with a ranged weapon, her target rolls minus two defense, which is pretty decent actually. So there you go. So those are our heroes. The villains we're fighting this round are the, we have two returning characters from the first uh, mission we played. We've got Weeble and Scuttlebutt, uh, a, a Britney favorite. <laughs> so Britney's a fan of Scuttlebutt. The way this works is after we completed mission one, Britney was the winner. So she got to choose two upgrades uh, first from all the upgrades that were available after, because there's basically piles of upgrades. There's like you bring out a stack after you complete mission one, then you bring out a stack after you complete mission two and they're specific to which mission you completed. Um, anyways, we laid them out on the table. Brittany got to pick two, then Jess got to pick two because she got the second amount of points, and I did pitiful, and uh, I think I got almost half of even you because you had 16 out of nine. That was, I was, that was pretty bad. So I got, to, but at the, being last, I get to pick four in a row, which is good, and then Jess picks two, and then Brittany picks two. So we picked all that up, and after that, you get to pick one more upgrade per badge. And when I'm talking about upgrade, and badges are what you're awarded based on I can't remember how you get the first badge. The first badge is the person who completed the mission or the person who got the most points in the mission. And then you get uh, an additional badge for every seven experience points 
you earned. And those badges are spent for more upgrades. So this is what an upgrade would look like. Actually, this is a standard upgrade, actually a starter upgrade. So let me give you an example of one that we actually bought. Eh. We have like mob boss. So the, the weapons I picked out, um, you know what we'll do? We'll just do a nice photo of these mm -hmm. and then we'll just overlay them now. So I picked up mob boss, impale, VPN cloak, and ion shield. Oh yeah, also got the drain plugs, which I can't even use until I get a special weapon to combo it with, but it's just sitting there. And these girls had so many power-ups, actually had to discard some. I didn't. I, I have room to hold power-ups I can't even use. So what were your, your new ones? I don't even remember now. What, you've got the- I got Bubbly Boy 3000. Okay. I got the Blast Vest, Ion Shield, the Mob Boss, the Sonic Nunchucks, Stock or Shock Staff, and the Bayonetta. Bayonetta? Bayonetta. Bayonetta. Is that what it's called? Because I don't have it. <laughs> so I'll take your word for it. Oh, and I also got the Repeater Pistol. No, Repeater Pistol is a starter weapon. Oh, okay. Never mind then. <laughs> Scratch that. All right, what did you get? Uh, the new things I got the Shock Staff, the Blast Vest, Bubble Boy 3000, Sonic Nunchucks, the Bayonetta, and the VPN cloak. Okay. And now, one thing that's uh, new this round, which we didn't have the first round, was the um, these things, which are the, um, oh, what are they called? Or a reaction, the reaction upgrades, I believe is what they're called. So how these work is when you get attacked, you get to use uh, these in reaction to them. So they'll usually do things that deflect attacker, make you target something else. The VPN cloak makes the attacker must choose another target. If there are no other targets, you may not use this upgrade. So that's one. And then the bubble boy is the person who attacks you automatically gets one hit back. So it's like the shot ricochets back. Okay. So I think that's it. Uh, I like how my guy looks like, uh, I don't like Tron, but I always like the character design and that's what my character looks like. Good. Well, she I love like all Tron. the minis. I think every single yeah. mini in this game is they really look good. Awesome. All right. Now, one thing you'll notice is I put these experience tokens here. They're not supposed to be there. I just wanted to indicate, uh, to make it easy for everybody, that's where your cars can go. So Brittany, since you won the first round, you get to put your car at any of those doors and then we'll take the XP away. You don't actually earn those XP. That's just an easy way to mark it. Oh, one buddy I forgot to bring up. He's new. This is a peek around. Look at that. Does he look cool? He's one of my favorite minis actually. So the peek around, He's got an ability, which I don't know if you, you girls know. He's got Spray and Pray. When attacking, peek around may target an additional hero in line of sight. He's awesome looking. I really like him. Mm -hmm. And he's tougher. His health is 5. His overkill is 7. His movement is 3. That's not, that's not new. But his uh, X, XP when you kill him is 2. And we ran out of XP last time because we were... I think you know why we get so much XP is because we spend so much time trying to screw each other over. That it makes the game last longer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Could be. But anyways, we got tokens from another game that if we run out of XP, we're dipping into those. Mm -hmm. All right. So, Brittany, place your car. Oh, and one more thing. Uh, before we get started, if you're interested in any of our other videos, like the first playthrough or the unboxing of this game to see all of the components, see it in the description below this video. Yep. Oh, and we're, we've also started taking donations. If you want to help the channel and help us just with all the equipment and stuff that we need to all just support us. Because, yeah, because we don't, uh, like, we're not getting paid for this. We're just, we're doing it for you guys and for us. We just like doing it and being part of the community. So, um, yeah, if if you guys want to donate, I think Brittany set that up. So we'll put mm -hmm. a link in the description. And uh, I think that's it. Cool. Right. Okay, let's start. Brittany, go. Before you start, sorry, do we find out the mission? Oh, yeah. It's a good point. It's a good point. Good. good call, Jess. All right, the mission. Ah, let me bring it over here so we can see. Okay, so these are the mission cards. So, quest one, counter, <laughs> counter intel. Uh, uh, um. This is scenario 2B, by the way. That's what Ruby chose after we completed one. Because it branches off, so you get to choose 2A or 2B. Yep. Okay, the PvE quest. To reveal a quest token, which are these things, you see them on all the, they're these mm -hmm. little purple things. Don't flip them over because there's color, they're color coded underneath. Okay. Where all you, wherever you see these two, these uh, blue guys, they're all on top of one of the quest tokens. So, 
To reveal a quest token, players must end their activation of a hero on the computer terminal containing tokens without any enemies in their space in tiles 1, 2, 3, or 4, which was 1, 2, 3, or 4. This one does not have anything. This quest is completed once the green quest token and red quest token are revealed. And the person who gets that gets three victory points. Oh, what does it say? Three victory points per green quest token or red quest token revealed. Oh, so you're going to get three quest tokens per quest token revealed. Sorry, three people, three XP points per <laughs> quest token revealed. All right, let's go. Okay. So the only ones that aren't a portal is orange, correct? Correct. Oranges are their spawn zones. Okay, I'm gonna go here. You're in front of me. All right, back. Ah. Ah. Robocop, he's been drinking. Murphy. I'm gonna switch seats. Yep. You can put him in the driver's seat. Yep. Okay. Uh, all right, now it's my go, and I am gonna go. Here and that layout is fine for me. I'm going to go here. All right. Now, if you notice, one thing that we we didn't have the first time around is these doors. Yeah. Check this out. These are part of the upgrades. <laughs> so these are one of the add-ons you could get for the Kickstarter. Cool. Because normally they're just little cardboard things. Mm -hmm. But to open a door, um, you can spend a move action. Mm -hmm. So you could. It just counts as a move action. So you can move to open a door, move the move your last one. So that's it. Okay. So it doesn't stop your movement action. And then the door stays open? Yeah, but somebody else could spend a move to close it. Okay. Which mm -hmm. could be handy. It slows people down behind you. Also blocks line of sight. So mm -hmm. it, it's handy. Although it gets you into this room, which has an open door right there anyways. So. Okay. All right, Britt. All right. So I'm going to move my Cybot. I want to call him Robocop. Just call him Robocop. Or Murphy. Okay, I'm going to go that was his real name. one, two, three to the green one in there. Green. Oh, you're teleporting. I I'm teleporting. I didn't realize three, you were a teleporter. Four. Uh, you know if you move out of space, they're both going to attack you. All right, so let's do this. So you want to go here, so they're going to attack you. So yes. that's Jess. You're going to roll for, let's do the Weeble first. Because okay. this... By moving for people who, for you guys who are new, oh, so because then, hold on one second, because Brittany is leaving a um, a space that is adjacent or close is the term used in this game to an enemy, she, the enemy's attacker. Mm. All right, so Jess. So maybe I should have attacked instead of moved. You can stop there and attack if you want. Maybe I'll do that. Huh? So Brittany has changed her mind. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna attack. All right, so who are you attacking? Which one hits harder? Uh, Scuttlebutt hits with four, and Weevil hits with two. Okay, Scuttlebutt. All right, so Jess, roll two. And I am going to use Your nunchucks. my nunchucks, which is three. Gives you three melee dice? Yes. Okay. And then I'm also going to use my mob bus. Boss, Not boss, which allows me for each character close to the target, including yourself, roll plus one die. All right, so that means you're gonna roll two extra die because if your target is Scuttlebutt, right? Then there's the Weeble, and um, Robocop is next is next to him. So that means you. Oh, for two. each character, so I get six. So let me see, how much do you nunchuck? So I nunchuck so are one or three. No, hold on, let's talk this through. Your okay. nunchucks give you three. Three. And, and then your mob I... boss gives you plus one. one. And then for each character close to the target, including yourself, roll plus one die. Okay. So then two. So yeah, so there's two targets close to, or two other characters close to your target. Yes. Okay. Okay. So you're rolling six, right? Yes. It's a lot. Ready to defend, Jess? Yep. Let's do this. Oh, okay. and you're looking, and you're doing melee, right? Yes. So you're looking for knives. And you got... Three plus a crit. Oh! That was a crit. I saw it. So crits mean that, um, Brittany, crits are a success, no matter what you're trying to do, defend, ranged, or melee. So, um, 
But if you roll a crit, bonuses, you get to roll an additional die. Mm -hmm. So roll your additional die. Ah, I got Yeah, you got another knife. Okay, so your so total. Yeah. Five. Five total, not bad. Defend it. One fence. Oh. So I hit him four. You hit him for four. So that was the scuttlebutt. Mm -hmm. And that's overkill, so you do not he does not retaliate. Excellent. You have to do better, Jess. Sorry. She's gonna run all over us again. This can't happen. And I get an XP. Yep, you get an XP. Don't spend it all in one place. Thank you. Okay. So then we oh, have yeah, to event. Do an event. Good call. Good call, Jess. Yeah. Alright. The event. Bam. Oh, you get to control no one. Because it's it's calling for a trooper. On level three, there's no level three trooper, but you get to do the ability because this is a glitch. So choose two different monsters on the board and swap their positions. They're all the same right now. No, they're not. You, well, there's scuttlebutts and weevils. So you could group. Yeah, you put two scuttlebutts together and two weevils together. Or if you wanted a different person to fight, you yeah. could change the person you're fighting. Then yeah, I'm gonna switch. Okay. Only this guy, only the peek around. His health is five, and he's not even on the table. Okay. okay, so you're done your event, my go. From Yuri, when attacking with a melee weapon before choosing a target, she may move a character one space. Oh, I made a terrible mistake. She has no melee weapons. <laughs> I thought it was when she targets a character. I made a terrible mistake. <laughs> the girls have taken pity on me because I didn't realize, uh, and it is hard to keep track when you're hosting and playing, but they're gonna let me switch Yuri and Alpha because uh, Yuri's abilities trigger only with melee attacks and I gave her absolutely no melee weapons. <laughs> uh, Alpha had all the melee weapons. So, let's try that again. <laughs> uh, so I'm still gonna go with, um, I'm still gonna go with Yuri, so she's gonna, except she's gotta move. She's going to target Robocop. How? Oh, there's a wall there. Oh, there's a wall! I couldn't see through his, his fat head. <laughs> Hold on. So one, two, three. There you go. Do you pick up the experience? Oh, I do. Thanks. Okay. I'm also just going to move this. Oh, yeah. Because I was Good tracking call. it, so... Ugh, terrible oh, aim. That was, that was close. <laughs> I don't think we've been able to get one in yet. All right. All right. <laughs> so, um, Yuri is going to attack Robocop. But when she... Uh, when attacking with a melee weapon, which that's all she has now, before choosing a target, she may move a character one space. I will move, now check this out. I am gonna move, I'm gonna move Robocop one space. No, I'm not, I'm gonna leave him right there. I'm gonna move him, I'm gonna move Alpha one space. Alpha also says, when his ally is activated, Alpha may move up to two spaces without triggering guard reactions. So he's gonna move two more spaces. One, two. And now Yuri is actually gonna finish her attack. And she's going to use her Pulse Blade, which gives her three die. She's going to combo that with Mob Boss, which gives her uh, one plus two, because there's two adjacent characters to the target. Mm -hmm. So that's two more. Uh, so that's three three die total. Uh, Are sorry. you attacking... Robocop. Okay. So I'll use Mob Boss. And I'm also going to use Impale. Which is your attack also targets an additional enemy close to the target. So I'm actually going to attack Scuttlebutt as well. Now, when targeting multiple targets, how it works is you roll once for both targets and both targets have to block for that one attack. So if I roll really good, they both have to respond to that. If I roll really bad, I lose on both of them. So I might as well also use Iron Fists, which gives me another plus one. So I just went, I used my Pulse Blade and I put everything on it. <laughs> I put Mob Boss, Impale, and Iron Fist. So let me make sure I got this right. Three for Pulse Blade, three for Mob Boss, one for Iron Fist, oh, and plus one for Impale. So I'm rolling eight dice. Score hits on Knives, and I'm targeting, both these guys are gonna get targeted. Targeted Scuttlebutt and Robocop. So question for you, for mine. Um, so the blue ones never exhaust, That's right? That's correct. And then for, I have Shock Staff, and it says when defending, plus two re-roll even when exhausted. Yeah. So, so that means that would be a re-roll when I'm defending against yeah. you. Yep. Okay. So roll cops have a lot of defense. That's why I have to go for a lot because his ability is when he rolls a crit, he gets, he blocks two, one crit blocks two. Mm -hmm. So he's a bit of a pain in the ass. So I'm going, so I'm going all out on the, oh, my shield, my island shield also gives me an extra die. So I'm going to roll 
Brittany's blue. I just realized I had an extra melee. Oh, uh, melee. Melee. All right. Yeah, I just noticed that too. Oh my gosh, I got so much this okay. yeah, I'm rolling nine, so I, I borrowed one of your, your die. Oh, okay. All right. Let's see what we got. Okay. What did you need? I need knives. Excellent. So quite a bit here. Um, so I got five hits already. Damn. The guns are misses. And I get three, because of those, I get three additional rolls. Oh, oh. Ho, 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 ho. ouch. Ah. And I get one additional roll. Oh. You hit me with all nine. 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 Ouchie. Holy crap. Well, if anybody's going to defend it, it's going to be Robocop. Do it. Oh, That's going to hurt. How many do you roll to defend? I roll seven. Yeah, because he rolls four naturally. The ion shield gives him two more. And where are you getting your seventh? I have oh, a yeah, blast another. vest. You also have a blast vest. So I... Roll your seven first, and then we'll deal with... We'll worry about your re-rolls. Because you can re-roll a total of... Um, your blast vest gives you a re-roll, right? Yep. And your staff gives you two re-rolls. Do you have anything else that gives you a re-roll on him? No. So you get three re-rolls. Yes. Okay. So you're good. Okay. Knock yourself out. Do it. Oh, oh one. my god. Yeah. That's what I like to see. One. No crits. Oh. You, and you get to you get to re-roll. Three, right? Yeah. Oops. Oh, oh two. Oh my god. That's gosh. you're just obliterated. Let's so just, that counts as four for your character. No, right? it's only when she gets crits. The crits count as oh, two. Oh, I see. But I defended... Did I defend two? Defended two. Okay. I hit you with nine. You're done. That <laughs> <laughs> pretty much get rid of any character here. So let's take Robocop off the board. Just put him over there. So what's this is the first time I've done this. I've actually triggered the, the PvP thing. So I killed somebody from the blue team. I've never done this before. It's very exciting. I've been killed many times to award points to other people. This is the first time I got them. So bam, I get two PVP rewards. Yeah. Nice. Do you know when we were doing it? Yeah, we just did. Okay, it's two because normally you get one. So I got two. Oh, and, and. There's get, more. There's, yeah, because there's a Give first. Give me back my dice. Hold on. First person <laughs> that finish completes a PVP quest, they get the, oh, the bonus. Oh yeah, you get the bonus. Because uh, Brit. Uh, last match got jury the, rig. the jury rig, which improves her melee attacks. Mm -hmm. We're gonna take a second to find this. Right. Remember that time I stopped talking to you because uh, I got killed early in the game? Yeah. <laughs> right. Sounds like a threat. <laughs> okay, so here's the thing. Um, just brought up that I, I might have said that we we're playing 2A, but we're playing 2B. And because we're playing 2B, check it out. And I was the first one to complete a PvP mission uh, quest, which was kill Brittany, um, I get this. As you can see here in the corner, it says uh, reward for 2B, and the SQ is for uh, Stargate quest. So this is, it gives me plus one health, and exhaust this upgrade to ignore guard reactions for this turn. So there you go. So exhaust this upgrade to ignore guard reactions for this turn. That's pretty good. It's called Ghosting shell. Oh, it's a like ghost in the shell. It's a ghosting shell. Okay, so this who got that? That was Yuri. So that means I need to get rid of one of her things. Oh, she's got all good things. Sucker. I don't want to hear it from you. Uh <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm gonna get rid of the iron fist. I want to say I feel bad for you, but I don't. Yeah. I need. I'm assuming I can do this right now. This one thing I don't know, so I'm just gonna make the call. If anybody gets anything, you just toss it in because mm -hmm. we've never got anything new with a full board before. So this yeah. will be gone. I did. Sense. What do you mean? No, you did. You got something new, but your board had room. You still no. had spaces. Board was, you still had spaces. It was the first match. You couldn't possibly have. Oh, you throw. mean during the game? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. yeah. So I'm getting. I thought you meant during the upgrade because I'm like I upgraded yeah. a lot. So I'm getting rid of Iron Fist. That means Iron Fist is gone for me for good. Uh, because once you get more than twelve, you have to discard. So that was me. Yuri's got now Ghost Shell, Ghosting Shell, which is pretty cool. So that was it. That was a long turn. Oh, I'm not. It's not done. We got uh, Scuttlebutt. He's got to defend the nine. Brittany right. took my the, my hit away. Scuttlebutt's gonna defend the nine. So that's you. Oh. Scuttlebutt rolls two. Did 
defended. Oh, he defended too. Still gets obliterated. <laughs> Oh, so uh, the nine goes against the other. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The full nine. When you target somebody, when you get additional target, mm. the one roll goes for all your targets. It doesn't get split up. No. So it's just like a double yeah, win. Yeah, you just use oh. the same one on both. That's powerful. Um, so, at least that's how I understood it. If I'm doing it wrong, please, if you see any mistakes, mistakes happen, be kind, leave them in the comments, and we'll, if we get them in time before we put up the next video, we'll uh, correct. But that's how we've been playing. Mm. Okay, so he's dead, so I get an XP for killing Scuttlebutt. And now I get to do the event. Um, okay, oh, I get to move uh, an officer, a level one officer, which we have. And I also get to summon any troop. So first let's move our level one officer. Oh no, we don't have one, he's not on the board. So I get to place this guy on the board. Ooh, look at him, I love him, he's awesome. He's so he's so cool, he's like, look at him. He looks pretty cool. He's such an awesome mini. All right, so let's put him. Jessica's coming in through that door, so... And she's gonna go after all that XP. Yeah, well, so we'll, she'll have to deal with him if she goes in there. Okay. Uh, and that's it, and then I get to summon any trooper. So we got some scuttlebutts to summon. And I will put him right there, since Brittany likes the scuttlebutts so much. All right, that is it, that's my turn. Sorry, that was a long turn because of all those all that success success takes a while it's not it's not a one it's not easy it just doesn't happen you have to work for it oh my gosh i just want to flip this table <laughs> <laughs> it's a heavy table i like to see you try <laughs> maybe one of those things where like a cartoon you would to flip it but your arms stay down because the table's so heavy <laughs> all right jess okay i got you it's nixie it's nixie one two three four. Oh, she's a teleporter a lot of teleport use this time. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to attack the Scuttlebutt. I have the ability when attacking with a ranged weapon, my target rolls minus two. So oh. they don't get to roll any defense. <laughs> I want to see this ranged weapon being used. Uh, so I'm going to use... Oh, how bad am I at rolling? <laughs> um, so I'm going to use my re repeater pistol. Repeater pistol, do it. And I'm going to use my Kitty Primed and my Bayonetta, which is probably overkill, but I have them all. What does that give you total? That gives me six. Six die. All right. So I'm terrible at rolling. We'll see how this goes. What did you need? <laughs> well, she I got, got three. three. You got yeah. three. Oh, wait, so you needed. You can get, the guns. keep rolling to see if you get overkill. Because you got you've already killed him. Because you got yeah, you oh, did yeah. four is an overkill, so you got him. Okay. So and does, did you get any re-rolls with that? She did. No, well, she doesn't have to re-roll. Right, she's done. Yeah, okay. Because he can't defend. Because she stopped him from rolling his two die. Mm. So, you get this. And okay. I'll take Scuttle. I'll take Scuttlebutt off the board for you. Scuddy. All right. So, that was good. Now Ready? an event. Now your event. Wow. Ooh, you get to move an officer level two, which we don't have. But you get to summon any trooper. So as you can see, there's no officer level two. I don't know if you can see that on the camera. Yeah, you can. There's no yeah. officer level two. So if it calls for anything, it has to be a card that's on there. So we have no officer level two and no trooper level, level three. So summon a trooper. And so that's a scuttlebutt is the only thing that's available. I'll put it there. It's uh, what, that was it? That was it? Mm -hmm. I had a plan. Was it to stay in the car? Because you're doing a great job ah, staying in the car. Well, really I forgot well. that the car has two spaces. Uh, so I, in my head, I already had my whole move planned out, and then was like, oh, poop. Uh, poop. Okay, move me. One. One. Two. Two. Three. Three. Portal? Portal. To this, I guess. Yeah. Well, you could go there, but there's nothing there. I'm going to attack you. You dare attack Yuri? Yes. Curry and Yuri, they come in the same... You know what? Box. Don't give me that sad They're sob buddies. story. They come in the same box. They're buddies. They're friends. Oh, yeah. You can have two people in one square, correct? Maximum two Max people. Maximum two. You can walk over a space if somebody has two people. We can't stop it. What's your yeah. defense? For is there five? Yuri is, she rolls, well, it's more than five. It's five, six, seven. She rolls seven for defense. Yuri does not mess around. She's got her eye on shield. She getting prepped. All right. Oh, and she's got plus one health. I gotta remember, her health total is three. Mm. I'm gonna move this up here just so it's easier to see. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna use my blaster rifle. 
my Bayonetta, um, and my Kitty Primed. So that gives me seven. Okay, cool. Now the cool part is, check this oh, out. Watch. Eight. When attacking a target close to you, one extra die. All right, fine. But hold on, hold on. You're not going to need that one extra die. Why? Because I'm going to use my VPN cloak, and you have to attack. The attacker must choose another target. If there are no other targets, you may not use this upgrade. But there are other targets. Right here. And you're using a ranged weapon. So it's perfect. If it was a melee weapon, he was he wouldn't be a legal target. But the it bayonetta is, is It's it's well, still ranged. It's a ranged. It's a ranged. It's a ranged upgrade. I hate you. Oh <laughs> but you know what? You're not close to him, so you're gonna have to get rid of that one die. Yeah, you go. That's pretty good. Oh yeah, scuttlebutt. Let's just turn you right around. Yeah, that gets two. Well, let, let's sh show the people. This is, this is what's happening. I got, this is a reaction card. So Brittany decided to attack me and I decided to go into my VPN cloak, which I assume is like Harry Potter's cloak of invisibility. Like I was there and I was like, Phew! and you're like, where'd he go? Well, I'll just attack Scuttlebutt since he's here. And you're looking for guns. guns. You got oh. four, four so far and you get to roll an additional two. Not bad. Respectable. Yeah, the uh, Scuttlebutt only gets to defend for two, so. Well, you could defend, you could keep getting crits. That's true. Oh, boom, six. Now, Scuttlebutt can just get crit, crit, crit and keep rolling. Or, or absolutely nothing. miss. Why do you suck so hard? <laughs> <laughs> when it comes to rolling for the enemies, <laughs> it's just a cakewalk for Brit. You're like, bam, eight dice, all miss. Remember? Uh, I saved the good ones for me. <laughs> 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 okay, so you killed Scuttlebutt, you obliterated him, he doesn't even get to attack back. Chris isn't here, someone has to represent. Somebody's gotta represent <laughs> the bad rolls. Uh, Poor Chris. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't get to defend. He him. made his bed, now he gets to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so ready? Bam. You get to, ooh, you get to move the Weeble and summon any officer. Um, so can I summon that big yeah, guy? Oh, I gotta weeble. move the Weeble first? Move him like anywhere? Uh, well, you move them normally. You don't just pick them up off the board. You you move them. You activate. Oh, like you move them. You're, you're activating a, a weevil, as okay. in you move them, attack with them, or attack and move with them, whatever. Okay. Attack and move with them. Do it. One, two. That's a wall. Oh, you're teleporting. Is that what you're doing? No. Okay, what are you doing? Let me be on my space. Okay, he moves three. One, two, three. Is that what you're doing? Yes. Okay. And then I have to move an officer. No, nope, you don't. You get to summon any officer. There's okay. only one officer to summon. Okay. You I, may place. I'm gonna it. put him on that orange space. With alpha? Yeah. No. Oh. Why pumpkin. Would you do that? Pumpkin. Don't pumpkin me. Look at how big he is. You can't even see your guy from my angle. That's terrifying. I got it's an terrifying. <laughs> I got Terrifyingly your... awesome. I got your angle right here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We good? I don't know. I'm still upset. Yeah, you're done. All right. <laughs> Okay, so here's what is gonna happen. All right. So, uh, interesting, interesting, interesting. All right, I'm gonna go one, two, pick this, I gotta end, she's got end her activation in here. Does that mean you can still attack from there? No, I can't, I gotta no. end, I gotta end okay. her activation. So, oh, it's a red one. It's one of the ones we're looking for. So we're looking for, what colors are we looking for? Green and red. So I got that. And because I found a red one, I get three victory points. Oh no, it's uh, per green quest token and red quest token found. Yeah, so I get three victory points. Excellent. That quest is still going on though. Um, but because I activated her, Alpha, his ability is, he gets to move two spaces without triggering guard reactions. Oh. So he's gonna Aren't go. Aren't you lucky? Yeah, one, two. So normally- It's a good combo. Yeah, it is. And he gets uh, the stim pack, which heals heals him if he gets damage. So I got to move away from this big bastard without taking any damage. It's quick. <laughs> ba bam All right, I get to do care package. So, so I'm moving a scuttlebutt and I get to choose two different spaces containing gadget slots and place one gadget on each. Okay, let's move a scuttlebutt first. And we're gonna go one, two. So you just went over a wall. It's teleported. Thank you very much. Oh. Wow, wow. Scuttlebutt has moved. And now he's not happy with you uh, for killing his buddy. 
He's he's I'm not impressed. So he's gonna attack you for four. And he's looking for knives. Oh, oh, this is not good. He's hit for three and he gets to roll two additional ones. Oh, uh, so he hit a total of four. How are you defending there with Chica? Seven. Seven! Is it seven all the time? It's, yeah. It's six? Oh yeah, it's always seven for eight. Right? Always seven. No! 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 Well, I'm not attacking Robocop, it's the wrong I'm attacking guy. Curry. Three. Nope, four. I hope you only you didn't roll seven last time. He's never been right. attacked. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the attacker suffers one wound after the attack. It, yeah, you're gonna flip that? Yeah, so flip it now. Does it get flipped? It's after the attack, yeah, if it gets flipped, um, it gets used. But I don't have to use that now. No, you don't have to use it. You have to use it when you, I think you have to use it when you get targeted. Okay. Oh. Okay, so uh, that's a. But I get to reroll one. All right, you might start a chain reaction here. See what you got. Oh. Yeah. I'm not rolling well today, okay, so, but I will be. So you get hit by four. So I'm dead. Yes. Scuttlebutt killed you. What a what a dick, right? What a scuttlebutt. So that's two XP for each. Of, that's XP for each of us. There you go. Thank you. I hope he kills you. Me, me and Scuddy are friends. We're buddies. Hey, remember me, Scuddy? I saw him kill your buddy. I saw him kill your brother. All right. Uh, so, well, I get to do the second thing, which is choose two different spaces containing gadget slots and place one gadget on each. So, I will take, pass me a stim pack. Which is that this? One, yeah. And I'm going to put that right there. And for the other... Was there one there before? Yeah, I took mm -hmm. Oh, okay. And now for the other location, I'm gonna put, or just give me a lightning bolt on the energy, whatever are they, the recharge kits. There you go. So that's what I'm doing. Okay. All right, goo. Okay, I am going to, which one do I wanna do? So now we're just looking for the green. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to take Calvin and move one to, Teleporting? Yes. Okay. Three. Yeah. And if you move into that space, yep. he will attack you. But I can't pick it up. Correct. You can't pick it up while he's in there. Okay. I'm gonna stay there. And attack. Okay. And I'm going to use my shock staff and my iron fists to roll. Is that a total of four? Don't forget to get to reroll all your dice with him nice. if you want. Oh, you're looking for you're looking for melee, right? Yes. So you probably want to reroll that anyways. It's pretty good. And so you get to roll a bonus die. You get to reroll two. Oh, two bonus dice. Nice. Nice. Oh, and another one. Why wow, you're gonna obliterate him? Oh, you know what I'd like to see? I like to see one of the bad guys against a big hit like this just defend everything because they hit like they roll crit, 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 <laughs> and just keep protecting. I don't want to see awesome. that. I'll be honest. Unless it's against well, you. Yeah, I don't want to, well, I don't want to see it against <laughs> me. Uh, okay, so what am I defending here? You are defending... I mean, what is Weevil defending here? Weevil <laughs> is five? defending... No, but you're no, doing... sorry. You got five total? Six. Six? Oh, six. Okay. And that's a total miss. Uh, so he's dead, and again, you've obliterated him. You know what we've been doing this round? We've totally been just, like, evaporating these guys... Because mm -hmm. the first round they kept attacking us back, but this mm -hmm. time we're like off the map. I think it's because better we're stronger. Stuff. Yeah. Thank you. Well, you guys are. I changed my characters and now I feel sad. <laughs> you still have a really strong character though. I know it's just me. Really? Only issue. Well, Curry is suffering from the same problem. When we played Chris. with Chris, Chris played Curry, and Curry has an ability where he gets to heal at the end of every, at the end of every turn. But right? he's so weak. But that... he dies every turn. <laughs> <laughs> so he just gets He's wiped out completely, so, so it's not easy to heal. I now understand Chris's frustration. Alright. I was hoping to prove him wrong, but... Maybe you should have sent Robocop in. Oh, you did. Sorry. I forgot. Oh my it's, too it's, <laughs> too it's too soon. It's too soon! That was, that was a mistake. It's that was, too soon! I was honestly... I completely forgot he was dead. Uh, and, uh, did I, I, and I killed him. I'm sorry. That was a mistake. I, was, I didn't mean to say that. Okay, so your event, Gateway Current. Choose a monster on the board and place it on any portal. 
Whose twos is that? Is that you? So you get to move. Oh, there's nobody for you to move. So just do the second part, which is choose a monster on the board and place it on any portal. It's a bit of a dick move. It's a good <laughs> move. You're right, it is a dick move to try to block somebody's play with a character, with a monster. I wonder where she learned that from. No idea. <laughs> We're not her parents. We're not teaching her bad habits. <laughs> Here you go. We're bad influences. Well, I'm not. I'm an awesome influence. You're a terrible influence. Right here, influence right here. What am I doing? You're taking your turn, Britt. Which is, oh. consists of nothing but resting. <gasps> Too soon. <laughs> Get in your car. Ironically, you're blocked in by the weeble you placed there. Oh yeah, that's karma. So uh, Brittany gets to bring your characters back and unexhaust all their stuff and get all their health back. Uh, but that's all she can do and then she gets to your event. And your event is, ta-da! You get to move the third trooper, we don't have one. So, do the next step. Choose a tile. All characters with at least two life on that tile suffer one wound. I'm going to attack that tile with you on it. First of all, you're not attacking. It's an electrical failure. Thank you. <laughs> so, I'd like to think that my guys crawled on the outside of this of Just passing a bunch. place and I'll spread this, so I'll spread the love. All right, so Yuri takes a hit. She's at one health. Alpha takes a hit. He's still at three. He's all right. He's got a stem back. We got... Ugh. We got peak around. Both peak arounds are take a hit, hit, but they're still they got five, so they're a long way to go. And our scuttlebutt took one. Poor Scuddy. Take that scuttlebutt. All right. So, you happy? You done? You done your damage? So now, I am going to use Yuri again. And when attacking before melee. Will attack? Oh, I can't attack because she's got no friggin' stuff. This makes me so happy right now. Me, 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 I'm me, so me, happy. Me, me, me. <laughs> so I'm gonna go. Question before you go. So if she dies right now, do you drop that red stone? Uh, yes. So yeah, you have it in the wrong spot then. Continue. Sorry. Yes, she is. I'll be coming after it as soon as you die after this turn. Yep. Okay. If you drop the red stone, does that mean multiple people can get the three points? Because you already gave yourself the three points. I did. Well. So if you drop it, does somebody oh. else get three points? Yeah, yeah, I guess it would be. Yeah, that's right. Good point. Do you only get them once we find all of them? Yeah, so let's just put that there. Let's put the three Good points there. Good job, cool. Jess. Good call. Good call. That makes sense. That's why, that's why I keep you around. So you're part of Bordy and Pappy. Only okay. reason. <laughs> Only reason. And to get to the, the beer fridge. Oh my yeah. gosh. So really anyone <laughs> in the seat could do that. <laughs> it's really Chris, because Chris sits there. All right. Um, Same as Chris. <laughs> all right. So so here's what I'm, I'm going to do. Here's what I'm going to do. I'll tell you a story. It's going to happen like this. Oh, she can't attack. Fuck. She, she can't attack the melee weapon. Berg. Okay, I'm going to do this. She can't ghost. attack at all. I know she can't, but she can use her ghosting show. Exhaust this upgrade to ignore guard reactions for this turn. But don't you need to have that with a weapon in order no, to use an upgrade? No, it's a. Okay. It's not. It's a blue. It's a passive. It's like your armor. Okay. So I have to. Except I have to exhaust that one. I still get plus one health. Oh, that's right. I get plus one health from him. So she still has two health. Not as easy to kill as you thought. So she's gonna ignore guard reactions for this turn. Which means... She's hiding. She's going to go one. Do both your characters ignore guard reactions? Two. Their special ability... Uh, no, it was her oh. item. Her item that I got, the ghosting shell. So she went one, two. I don't think anything says I can't go in that room. Because he... The other guy that he has... Yeah. When when she re when she moves... Mm -hmm. Yeah, so here's... I didn't think the, this wasn't an accident. When she gets to move a character... When she activates, if she mm -hmm. melee attacks. And when she activates, he gets to move two spaces, ignoring guard reactions. Mm -hmm. But now she has Ghosting Shell. So that means she can use Ghosting Shell, ignore guard reactions. And after her move, he gets to move, also ignoring guard reactions. Wow, that's strong. So, um, What a great team. Anyways, I just want to make sure there's no rules to say it can't go in there. I don't think there is. 
because I've played a mission where behind a locked door you can't you can't go in there until, open it's, right here. until it's activated. Oh yeah, it's open right there. Or is this a wrong spot? No, no, it's there. It's the right spot. There's two doors in that room. So yeah, there's nothing saying I can't go in there. So why so, would you go through the door? Because you might be all, all the way over there. Hmm. So I'm gonna go one, two, three, four. So he's going after that. You better do it. She's gonna get there before I. I, I hope do. you do. I'm just running. You should. But she did activate. So because she activated alpha triggers, when the ally is activated, alpha may move up to two spaces without triggering guard reactions. So he's gonna go one, two, and he'll pick that up. Okay. So that is that, and then we do our event. Oh, I get to move Officer Number 2, which we don't have. Choose two different computer terminals and place an experience point on each. So let's choose this one. Boo. <laughs> and this one. All right. So I'm done. I'm going to use Calvin and go one, two. Ooh, it nice. scores us off three XP. Very nice. Three, four. All right, you know, staying friends. Mm -hmm. Okay, you get to control nobody, but you get to choose two different. Oh, same thing I did. I had, which was cryptocurrency iced. Mm -hmm. So you get to choose two computers and put XP on them. I'll give you these. Eh. I'm guessing the one right in front of you is a good option. <laughs> really? I have a plan. <laughs> but he's gonna get there before your plan. It's done. Token plate is token plate. She's got a plan. I do. Okay. Trust her plan. I don't want him coming over here. That's a bait. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bait. Hmm. But you gave it to him who's competing with you. But he could put it here. Hey, I mean, it's done. Remember? I'm competing with both you of you. Fine. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. Fine. <laughs> Fine. You gave him easy. Brittany's best move is to deflect attention. <laughs> no. Right. Whatever, I don't want to hear from you. You already won one. I don't feel pity for you if you start to lose <laughs> this one. I had nine points last turn. I scored them early, and that was it. Not last turn, last, uh, last game. I'm going to use my shock staff and my jury rig, which gives me four, and I'm going to attack the weevil. With your cybot. With my cybot. Robocop. Correct. And your do is a melee. Don't mm -hmm. forget your ion your ion shield also gives you a free melee. Oh yes, thank you. I keep forgetting that. I'm here to help. Mm -hmm. okay, so yes, you roll for me? You roll for the weedle. Yeah, it works out for you because she's been three. rolling like poo. For um, enemies. For enemies, for enemies, not for you. I just wanna say uh, fifty percent of the time. It's good. You can't even say well, it. You can't even 50 say the word. 50% of the time it's good and 50% of the time it's bad. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. All I'm right. just saying, you're taking your chances. Just roll. <laughs> okay. so what was I rolling for? Melee. So you want knives. So you got three. And you get to roll a bonus die. And. His thing's only triggered. And they get to reroll. Yeah. I can do. Oh, plus two reroll. But I only get four dice, right? Yeah, you don't get you only get to reroll the dice you have. Okay. Hey, Excellent. well there it hits. And you get to roll an additional die now because of that. And I'm rolling three for the weeble. Yes. Come on, Jess. Excellent. Oh for Jesus. And she obliterates him again. No no repercussions. <laughs> my, yep. Can I give you your I can give you your all right, so you're done. No, I can move. Oh yeah, right. Don't rush my turn. Usually we move and attack. So it's just get um, excited. All this talking makes me thirsty. One, two. Three. Okay. There's something under there, right? Yep. Okay. Ready? You're going to. Ba! Reinforcements have arrived. Oh, you get to control the peek around 
And then summon any trooper. So control the peek around. Okay. So I'll move with three. You move this guy? Yep. Toward me, I'm assuming? Yep. One, two, three. And take his heart. Oh. Yeah. You just love his heart. <laughs> I couldn't like I, it didn't even I, matter. I couldn't see it. It was for me, this guy's gun was in the way. <laughs> okay. And then what do I do? That's it? No, you get to attack with him. Oh, you get to attack. Excellent. I'll attack. He's him. ranged, by the way. You don't have to move that close, but I'm not saying it's a bad idea moving that close. I'm just, I'm just letting you know. Okay. All right. So when attacking, peek around, may target an additional hero. There's no other hero. So. How much do I roll with? You roll with. He attacks with four. I'm looking for guns. Two. Two. Okay. That's respectable. Uh, I rolled two, three. And I have one reroll, I believe. Yes. Whoa, that's not good. <laughs> one reroll. Hey, one! I take only one hit. Come on. Fine, fine, fine. All right. Am I go? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do it. I'm sorry. I'm gonna do it, Jess. I'll teleport. Might as well there. One, two, put me on the station. And I'm gonna end my activation there. You can kill me if you want. You can try. Oh, it's the it's a blue one, which means nothing. We're looking for a green one. So, do you still get a point for it? I get a point for the XP that was on there. But not the point, no, you don't get a point there's, for there's, I got a blue one. The blue is nada. Okay. So we'll just put this over here. Because we're looking for green and red. I got the red. So uh, so she ends her turn there, but because she did her activation, he gets to move. Mm -hmm. And he moves one, two, without triggering stuff. That's such a powerful one. Mm -hmm. It's handy. Not gonna lie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Um, so now I get to do my action. Ooh, I get to move a scuttlebutt. All right, and then I get to choose a type of monster. The next time a player kills that monster, the player gains one VP. All right. Uh, so I get to move a scuttlebutt. I think there's two of them there and there. All right. Let me see. Let me move three. I wanted to get him right on top of you, but I can't. I couldn't, anyways, because there's two people out in space. So I'll take him over here and put him right on Britney's space. There you go, there you go Robocop. Make yourself a friend. Scuttlebutt's like you. Oh, and then the I'm going to put the extra XP on the next person that, who kills a peek around. Gets an additional XP. All right. So, go. I'm going to take the Nixie and move her. One, two, three, four. Nice. Can I use both my characters? No. Okay. So I can only, if whoever I move, I have to attack with. Yeah. Okay. Nice try. Marty. Thought I'd ask. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ready? Yep. Wow. Reinforcements have arrived. You get to move peek around, and then you have to. Then you can summon any trooper. So move peek around. Either. I'll move him. Toward me, I'm assuming. Yep. Three. Yep. So it's gonna be on your space. Oh, one, two, three. Sorry, you're right on me. Yep. Sorry. Sorry. Alpha's nimble. He's been like. <laughs> he look. He looks good for that character too. Like it looks like he'd be speedy. All right. So rolling four. Um, to attack? Assuming you want to attack me, I guess. Exactly. <laughs> Let's go for it. Oh, oh what does she attack two. with? Um, uh, guns. Dang it. You, really got you two. have two, though. You get to roll two additional ones. No, 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 I just rolls. Yeah. Oh, those aren't the just rolls I wanted. Well, I would defend with three. You're going to miss. Miss. Oh, I defended two. How many did you roll? Damn it. Three? And I get to reroll one. So I'm going to reroll my one miss. Yeah! Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I'm not even, I can re another one. I can be another shield. Is it another shield? Is it another shield? No, it's not. But I don't need it. I don't need it. Suck it. <laughs> All right. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> okay. So, uh, that's it for you. Oh, no. You get to summon the something? trooper. Summon any trooper. Any trooper? Any of those, those guys are up there. A weeble or a scuttlebutt. And then 
I'm sorry, but it's too easy not to. Oh, no, I can't. Dang it. Sucker. On the orange space. Damn it. Oh, I was going to spit there. Well, the benefit of being near her, she doesn't want a monster there either. It doesn't look up for either of us. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right. You're up, Brit. Nunchucks? I guess I'll attack the... <gasps> Robocop with nunchucks? Shut up, I I'm assuming you'd be really good with them. You'd be very precise. Which one's the stronger one between the two again? Between the two of what? Like, who attacks with more dice between those two? Between these two? Mm. Um, scuttlebutt attacks with four. Okay, I'm gonna go after the scuttlebutt. Alright, Jess, defend two. Scuttlebutt defends two. So is that three? Okay. What does the, nunch what is the nunchucks oh, do? Oh, yeah! So nunchucks is when attacking with this weapon, plus one reroll, and then I'm gonna use the mob boss. For each character close to the target, including yourself, roll plus die. one die. So two. So two. And then I get an extra one for my iron shield. So seven. So assuming you do... Iron shield is only melee, right? And you're doing melee? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, he's all melee. He's all melee. Robocop's all melee. He's holding a gun. <laughs> what, is he <laughs> poking people with it? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Don't be so judgy. You put a sharpened pencil <laughs> on the tip. Don't be so judgy. Okay, Taking right. out eyes. Good. Oh, you're rolling. So you got. Oh, that's a good roll. We got five. Whoo, five hits. Yeah. You get to. Yeah, re rolls, don't you? Oh no, you don't. Oh that. yeah, I do. How much? You got one re roll. Um. From your armor. I get two re rolls. One re roll and one re roll oh, when attacking. Two re rolls. And you got two dice to re roll. How perfect is that? Mm -hmm. When you have, you always get a re roll, not yeah. just yeah. if you're defending. Okay. That's right. Oh. Oh, six. six. Ouch. Okay. Scuttlebutt, come on. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, have you, oh, rolled, no, that doesn't have you rolled a single defense for the enemy yet? <laughs> you <laughs> were, were fine with it for yourself. Yeah, you I, am fine. I am fine with it for me. Clearly, I'm fine with it for me. <laughs> okay. And now uh, I can move, right? Uh. Weevil's gonna attack you for doing that. Really? Yeah. Oh, right, because they move from my space. space. I always forget that. All right, well, we'll okay, let you I don't do wanna it. move. We'll let you do it because you were unclear on the rules. Sorry, I forgot. Okay, but that's it. Fine. <laughs> that was your one, <laughs> I forgot. All right, let's see what your event is. Boom. Oh, you get to move a scuttlebutt. It's a care package. And then you get to choose two different spaces containing gadget slots and place one gadget on each. But first, move your scuttlebutt. There's one right there. He's in that room by himself. Well, he's not by himself. He's with a weeble. Mm -hmm. But they've been arguing. It's awkward. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that's, uh, that's not a scuttlebutt. A scuttlebutt. That's a scuttlebutt. Correct. So there's only one scuttlebutt. Correct. Oh, poopy. Robocop's in, in range. One, two, three. Nope, just three. Fine. All right. You're going after Marty, were you? Uh, and you get to put two tokens on the spaces that have tokens. I I'm so, so happy to do that. So it's either stim packs or recharge kits. And they're all here? Is this the only place that has... It is. This is the only tile that's got them. Alright, so put them over there. Because there's only two Which options. Which one? Uh, would, yeah, what do you want to put? There's stim packs here. You can place one per... Well... How many do I have to place? Two. Oh, and one of those two. On these two? Mm -hmm. Okay, what so a place? stim pack... Well, you can... Stim pack has to go here. Okay. Or whatever it's called. And then, what are you going to put here? Stim pack or recharge? Mm, stim pack? Okay. Always been able to. You know, on this little tile, what I like about it? It's got their. It's Arcadia Quest, which is the. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Yeah, they're playing Arcadia Quest in there. This is what I've seen. I've never played Arcadia Quest. That was my guess. And somebody else, I think, in the comments mentioned that it was. Oh. Okay, so you're done? So, I am going to as much as I'd like to. Hang around. Uh, okay, I'm resting. I'm gonna rest. I'm resting so I get to unexhaust all my stuff. It doesn't heal my health, as far as I understand. <laughs> as far <laughs> as I know. Um, so everything's recharged. And when I rest, I can move things around. Uh, but I'm just gonna leave things as is. It seems to be working out okay. And my turn event is, come on, I want to move an officer. Nope. <laughs> I get to move a Weeble. 
So as far as moving weevils, let's move him right there. And then after that, I get to replace a portal with a portal token of any other color. So first, let's deal with the weevil. He's moved into your space and he's not happy. He doesn't like you on his ship. He's upset and he's gonna attack. And when the weevil attacks, he gets to re he gets a reroll of one. And he's looking for knives. Oh, and you get a reroll of one. Oh, two hits. Easily blocked. Is that how much he rolls? Yep, for defense. I see six, seven. Damn, he rolls seven every time? Yeah, and then these are worth two. Yeah, whatever, I don't hear. He's fine. So He's fine, he's fine, I get it. He's let's good. just add that up, just so that you know it's five defense. <laughs> oh, and I get a reroll. Okay. <laughs> so now I get to I get to replace. Sorry, yeah, just for the record, Hitch is sleeping under the table. On my feet. And Sorry. Brittany just like bludgeoned him. I'm a monster. With a dice. <laughs> I'm a monster. With a die. Okay, so. Sorry, buddy. I also get to uh, replace a portal with a portal token of any co other color. So let's do. Let's keep Marty away from that computer. Or Calvin. That's right, I'm watching you. Well, I'm not gonna move there, there's a guy there. I don't know, there's portals everywhere, I didn't know what to do, okay? <laughs> I just tried to make it seem like I knew what I was doing and I did it on purpose. <laughs> Ooh, no, not that. My plan is destroyed. <laughs> it, 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 mocking me, I appreciate it. <laughs> okay, um, okay, here you go. Okay. So Calvin is gonna get out of here and leave you by yourself. Um, so go. One, two, three, four. That weeble's gonna mess you up. And attack the weeble. What? <laughs> With a ranged weapon. All right. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna use my blaster rifle and my red dot sight. What did I give you? Roll four. Four die. Do it. Ooh, three. And my vest lets me reroll one. All right. Do it. I'd reroll one of those weeble up. The guns, right? Because you can get a crit, and then you can roll again. Uh, fine. <laughs> okay. And I defended two. You give me for four. Okay, so this is the first time he is dead. Mm -hmm. So you're going to get the XP for killing him. Thank you. He is dead, but because you didn't do overkill damage, mm -hmm. he gets to attack you back. Mm -hmm. This is the first time this happened in this game. So his attack is two. He's gonna attack. Yep. Oh no, we can't attack. Oh yeah, he can move and attack. So he's gonna go bam, bam. He wants to go right in your space. Right in your. It doesn't matter where he goes. He can actually go right there because he's gonna die either way. So he's gonna stay there. <laughs> and he's attacking you to boom. Oh, it's not looking good for you, Jess. Okay, it's not looking that bad. Uh, it was two. Okay, and I have. Okay, so I have to defend with two. And my dice gives me one more? Or my blast gives me one more? Blast yes. Blast? Okay. And you defend one. So okay. Take one damage. Grab zero. Ooh, bounty. This is where you get to choose an enemy crew. The next time the player kills a hero from that crew, the player gains an additional victory point. But what we're going to do first instead is... Control a scuttlebutt. And in case you guys have been following, it's because of these shields, if you notice. I don't know if you can see from the camera. That's one chevron, two chevrons, three chevrons, and then that's an officer with tags. So that's how you know where you can control. So you get to control a scuttlebutt. And they get to move three? They can move three. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Good choice. Finally, you made a good choice. Oh, <laughs> harsh! Oh, <laughs> shots fired. <laughs> God, it's harsh. <laughs> right. <laughs> Ouch! That even hurt. It stunned me. That stunned me. Okay, so what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? I attack you. All right, then do it. Uh, scuttlebutt attacks with, with four. four. I defend with. What do I need knives? Doesn't matter. Either way, you got two. 
So two, and I defend with uh, five, six, seven. I defend with, defend with seven because oh of my, my ion shield. Let's do this. I should just block doing this, not attacked. Oh, easily, easy defense. There's at least three on there. Oh, you hit me with <sighs> for two. Yes, yeah, so I'm done. I don't have to. I can roll an additional die, but no need. No need. Okay. And you're. Did he kill you? Just... No. No, he's not dead. He's just. She attacked me. He sits there. Mm. Okay, so it's your go, Brit. Okay, Is I'm gonna move. I no, he just woke up and he's just. <laughs> yeah, I hear him. <laughs> <laughs> Um, can you move, uh, Curry? Three, please. One, two, three. Yeah. And I'm going to attack the Weeple. Meeple. Weeple. He's a Weeple. 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... And his, his ability, for, for the record, is Wobble. Oh. So Weeble Wobble. That's what weevils uh, do. It's, it's, they wobble. It's adorable. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna use my blaster rifle Dang. and my bayonetta. Bayonetta. All right. What do you got? When attacking a target, choose uh, close to you. Roll plus one die. Oh, nice. Makes sense. It's a bayonetta. It's got a knife on the end of yeah. your gun. By the so way. three, two. Plus the one. Plus one. All right. So you're rolling six all together. Yep. Jess, you can do this. And I need guns. Guns, rolling for guns. Oh, yes. crap. That's a lot of guns. <laughs> That's a good roll. Yeah, five off the hop, and you get to... two rerolls. Well, not rerolls, or additional rolls. Additional rolls. Oh my god, do you have any. You wouldn't want to reroll anyway. No. All right, so hold on, hold on, hold on. What's the total? Let's put it in there oh. so we can see. Yeah. So you got seven. Ouch. You can do this. One. Well, he blocked so one. So he was sick. And everything else, he's just evaporated. There's nothing left of him. Um, yeah, he just goes here, and Brittany gets one of these. Excellent. He was evaporated into a piece of cardboard. That's what's Brittany got it. Okay. And your ability, your event is... Wait, can I move? Oh, no. I'm done. No, you're I'm done. done. Sorry. Electrical sorry. failure. So, electrical failure. Uh, you get to move... Oh, there's nobody for you to move. Choose a tile. All characters with at least two life on a tile suffer one wound. With at least two life. That's pretty much everybody. How many until he's dead? Him? Yeah. Um, he's he got has two, two more, He's right? got two life still on him. And she's got two life. Both of my guys got two life on him. Okay, I'm going to go after him. All right. Well, first of all, you're not going after him. Sorry. It's electrical elect failure in this room. That I caused. <laughs> Hold on. I got... I need one more heart. So you have also killed the peak of uh, the peak rounds. And you know what? They've been telling me they're not happy. We're going to join forces, and we're coming after you. You watch. What's new? <laughs> <laughs> I'm already so behind. All right. Can you sense my bitterness? <laughs> Here's what's going to happen. Alpha has, not, has yet to take his own turn. He's moved around this board without taking one single turn. <laughs> so here's what he's going to do. First, I'm going to activate Alpha. He is going to use a stim pack to heal himself to full. Boo. So let's put, let's see if I can get, oh, oh, I got the stim pack in the hoverboard. At least oh. you got it in something. Yeah, that's what she said. Mm. <laughs> I'm cutting that out. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Michael Scott. You got it, it's where we got to represent Michael Scott. Uh, anyways. Um, okay. So, stim pack, and now he's going to. I'm not going to move out of here without frying this guy. So let's... Balls to the wall. Let's do this. Attack for... So let's get three with my blaster rifle. Going to throw a kitty prime down there with plus two. Bam. And then it's red dot sight with an additional one. Bam. bam. And that is all. Oh, I've got a drain plugs, but I don't have a special weapon to use on. And I got one reroll. This goes so bad. Looking for guns. Looking for guns. And clearly I'm attacking the peek around. You're rolling for him. He rolls five defense, which is not cool. <laughs> but he's already got two hits on him, <laughs> thanks to you. So if I kill him, you help me do it. Does he need seven for overkill? Yeah. Looking for, looking for guns? 
Well, it's not bad. Three. Not bad. Not three, bad. And three. And I get. Uh, How many re rolls do you get? One. Not a re roll. One extra roll. dice. But don't you get a re roll? Oh, yeah. I do have a re roll. Okay, so I'm going to do a re roll first. That doesn't matter. Now I'm going to do my additional die. There you go. Hey, I got four. All right, so let's straighten that out. That's me that rolls. How much does he defend with? Five. That's a lot. I would have. This is where I'd prefer just rolling. That's fair. <laughs> two. Two. So you get to roll two more. Do I? Oh, right. Oh my gosh, I just had a moment. Okay. Hey, okay, just two. That's not bad. That's not bad. And he's still got, I'm not, he's not dead. No, he gets two more hits. He two more hits on him. So he's one hit away from death. But he's upset. So now he gets to do a retaliatory attack. So he gets to attack me. All right. Four. Bring it. Okay. Which one? Sorry. Sorry, I got distracted. Hitch just stole my slippers. <laughs> he attacks with four. Okay. Guns. Guns. I'm looking for guns. And I defend with three. Uh, two. Two. Okay. I defend with three. And I got a reroll. Let's do this. Let's figure this out. Come on. Bam. Oh, that doesn't count. Fill the box. Oh, I get additional, one additional die. I can stop this. Oh! <laughs> Oh, that doesn't count. Oh, oh, damn, that was a good one. Out of the box doesn't count, and it was a, it was a crit. crit. Oh, yes. that's our rules here. Out of the box doesn't count. So I got two, and you hit me with what? Two. Two? Oh, I blocked that all. How's this little dance? How's this for your little dance? As long as you didn't get the crit. Bam, 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 bam. Doesn't matter. I didn't need it. It was overkill. <laughs> all right. So he's done, and now I get to move no one. We're getting a lot of trooper three. Uh, choose a... Two different monsters on the board and swap their positiones. Ooh. Yeah. You know, Britt, this guy's gonna be easy for you to kill, so I'm just gonna put him over here and I'll deal with the weevil. He's almost dead. You're gonna get an extra XP when you kill him. So, right? Right side. Right side. As long as you overkill him. No, well, he's gonna get three. She's gonna get three XP. She's hmm. got this. Robocop's got this. He might just kill you. He might. He might, Rabbit. He might. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Done? Yeah. <laughs> I am going to move Calvin. I feel like Jess is just going on her own. She's, yeah, she is. She's she like shopping at Ikea. The, look at all her XP, too. Quiet but mighty. <gasps> <laughs> is this is good. Oh, uh, you got it. Oh, you got the yeah. green. Okay. Does that mean game over? No. What? No. What are you new? <laughs> There's two levels to the quest. <laughs> okay, so, so we each get three. Yeah, keep that one. So I get three, and you get three, because we're the only ones that contributed to this counterintelligence mission, nice. Brittany. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Next part of the quest is oh, ah, oh, it's good. Okay, so this is the next part of the quest. Uh, next part is place. One peek around on the computer terminal in tile five. So since this was Jess that triggered this, I'm mm -hmm. assuming she's the one that gets to pick the peek around. What's the peek around? These guys. So, Come so, on! <laughs> so what is the mission? The mission is, okay, so you get to place one peek around on the computer terminal in tile five. So he's going to go right here where oh Brittany God. is. That's me. Oh, that's yeah. you. Right here where you are, where you is. Oh, so you might want to pick where this guy. Where you is. Where you is. So... And to help recognize, and this is the spy. So to help recognize him as the spy, you place a quest token with this peek around. Mm -hmm. The first player to kill the spy peek around completes this quest and gets five XP, and then it's over. And if you put this guy, he's almost dead. Mm -hmm. So what you're gonna do? But then if you put that guy, then if I die, if I kill him and then he attacks me and I die, do I still get the points? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if you put him there, both me and Brittany get a chance to get there and kill him first. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. FYI, and he's only one kill away from death. So mm -hmm. you either want to make it hard on everybody, mm -hmm. or potentially the game will be over before it gets to your turn, because your your turn is done. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> so what you gonna do? Let me think about this. I mean, if it's this guy, and I put him there, Brittany would have to go one, two, three, three she four. Shoot him there. She got oh no, she doesn't have range. Yeah, which is enough. But she doesn't have any weapons. Do you have some range? But she has no weapons with the Robocop. 
Oh, I can still make it there. She has to go true. one, two, three, four, and she has range with that I guy. I mean, this one could yeah. go. Oh, yeah, one, you can just go one, two, two three. And he's going to have to go that far because he's got range. For you, you're there. You would have to kill the Weeble first. Or, or just move out. Yeah, same with that one. I'm going to choose the harder one. Okay. I'll, I'll do it for you since I'm closer. Land right there, he's going to be like, hey, remember me? I'm the spy. Let's put a quest token underneath him just so we remember that he's a spy. I don't know why we wouldn't, but just in case something happens. <laughs> okay. So, that's our spy. First person to kill him ends the game and gets... We're going to end it, because to end a game, you have to finish the two PvE quests and at least one PvP quest, which I already did that part. So... So it's Migrant. I like the hat on Nixie. Though I should have... Mm, I can't take back, can I? No, no take backs. Dang it. We're good. I should have let Brittany get the points. She might still get the points. No. How no. can she move? There's a guy there. There's no, no. way I can even... She, that guy can move. No. That's true, he could. Yeah, you can, yeah. can move and do a range. Can why, move. Can't, why can't he? He can't get there. He's he can, he's on a green, He's on a green, he's on a portal. Oh. Welcome to the conversation, Brittany. <laughs> oh my gosh, I feel like I'm so out of this game. All right, I'll try. One, two, now I'll do range. So I'm gonna use my repeater pistol, which allows me to use one boost upgrade that's exhausted. So I'm gonna use my. Oh, can I use my bayonet? Yeah, it's exhausted. No, but oh, you don't get the, you don't get the boost. No. But if I moved over one, I could. Yes. Okay. I'll say she hasn't finished her move yet. Mm -hmm. so it's um, I always forget that the diagonal's not no. close, even though it's, I know, I know, I'm sorry, I'm just saying. Uh, 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 okay, so I'm gonna use my bayonetta. So I get to, so two, uh, and two, and then I'm gonna use my kitty prime for another two. Oh, okay. And your bayonetta gives you an additional one, doesn't it? Because you're close to him? Um, when attacking a target close to you, roll plus one. Okay. And, yeah. Okay, so normally Brittany can't, wouldn't be able to use her bayonetta because it's exhausted. But the uh, repeater pistol allows you to use one unexhausted upgrade. So, okay. so we roll. How many of us? Eight? Seven. Seven. Okay. And you need guns. Hey, you flip your repeater pistol there. Cheaty biggie. That's right. All right. Come on, Jess. Stop this. Rule five. She needs guns. Guns, guns, guns. Oh, she got three so far. All right. Yes. I get. Do you have any rerolls? You have one reroll. I do. I have one reroll. So here's the reroll. Ooh. Ooh. So it's now like you get to roll three additional three. die. Ooh, that was a good one. Six. She got six total. Let's get okay. to that. And I'm rolling five to defend. Yeah, you got this. Oh my god! Yes! Nothing. What is wrong with you? <laughs> Hold on. But you rolled six? Yep. That is not enough to, that's enough to kill him, but it's not enough to obliterate him. So he is going to attack, attack you back. Attack me back, which is not good for me. So. Well, he, I'm rolling. Does he so. need a seven? What do you mean? He needs he a seven needs? to obliterate. Yeah, he needs seven. You hit him with six. Poopy. So four to attack? Uh, he attacks with four. Yeah, he needs a little ranged. Didn't count. One, yeah. One. One. And I defend with four. You make me sad. <laughs> oh. Oh, doesn't count. It's you already defended it. You're already good. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So he's dead. You get three XP for killing him because he's worth two normally, and we had a hunting season bonus on him. And then don't I get another five? Oh, yeah. You finished the mission. Bam. An additional five. That's right. Let's take that to one off there. That was just a real. Eh. So an additional five. So that is it. You've obliterated him. So we finished the mission. Brittany finished another mission. She's the mission finisher. That's what she does. We bring her in to finish the underdog. missions. Now let's count up some points here. Oh no, this is not looking good. I've got 10, by the way. I have 12. Get him last. I have 13. Oh, it's Ooh. close. This one was close. It was closer one, yeah. It's closer just because you guys did worse. I only did one point better than I did last time. <laughs> <laughs> so really, I'm getting better. You guys are getting worse. Just make sure I counted that right. There's, I don't know how. Okay. So. Five, 
13, 12. Okay, so that's good. So, Britt, you're dead. Stop counting your winnings at the table. No, I was just rude. thinking that I counted wrong. That's rude. Finished the same order as last time. Yep. So, we finished part two of the campaign. Brittany, once again, comes out on top. Way to go. The underdog. Brittany. Uh, she got that kill that just literally delivered to her. It was like you there. I picked the harder one. You did. There's nothing you could do. But I'm going to blame you anyways, because if it's not you, it's me. That's not a good choice. So, it's you. <laughs> uh, anyways. So that's it. That's what Jess gets for walking around by herself the whole game. You should have been more aggressive. Get in there. Um, what? I believe I'm, I'm I got for second. What I'm, did you get? Yeah, I don't want to hear it. Remind me? So you know I don't remember. If, you you, if you're second best, I expect you to take her down. <laughs> <laughs> I blame your rolls. <laughs> I blame your rolls. Your rolls are terrible. To switch uh, the order of the rolls next time. I just keep defense. losing. Yeah, I just keep losing. I think we gotta change seats or yeah. roll literally. <laughs> okay. No, it was a good game. Brittany, you did well. You did well, Britt. Thank you. You did well. You did well. Jess is like, no. <laughs> My hands are very cold. Yeah. Okay, so what did you think of this mission compared to the first one? Oh. I. I think I like the other one. What was the other mission? There was that one we had to... I don't remember what we had to do. We had to kill three guys. Kill three guys plus one of us. Yeah. No, there was three guys and there was and then three we guys had to the first part. Of, oh, we, we had to, to take the football and deliver it. Right. Um, I like this mission better. Just because I like the more complex board. Because mm -hmm. the other one was just a square. Mm -hmm. I prefer the layout of this board. And I, I like this guy. That is fun. I like that we were spread out more in this one. Yeah. Like, it felt like we each kind of had our own plan, where last time it was just, like, free-for-all, kill the monsters and kill each other. Even though I still came in last, I preferred my performance on this one, because I actually got to leave the first room. Well, he's still technically in the first room. But... <laughs> See, and I really didn't get, to, like, I was stuck. I we talked about You were here, here, and here. You were more than half the tiles on the level. Fine, whatever. I don't want to hear whatever. from you. Who's counting? Who's I'm, counting? I, at least I got the two <laughs> tiles this time, so I'm good. Um, the first game we played, if you watch that video, I never left the first tile, which is sad. Oh yeah, that's true. I never left the first tile. Okay, so I'm still enjoying, uh, Starcade mm -hmm. Quest. Mm -hmm. All right. Even, even if Brittany's winning. So that means now, Britt, you're going to have to get to, you get to choose two more upgrades first. Excellent. From the new, from the new batch. But I did get the, the cool upgrade, the ghosting shell, so I'm okay with that. I, I, I like my guy's performance. The I don't think the problem was with my characters. I think the problem was with me. And then we're done. Let's sign off on that. <laughs> All right, thanks, guys. Hope you enjoyed this. And remember, if you like this content, subscribe. And if you want to help us out, click on the link to donate to the channel. We could really use it. It helps us improve our equipment and bring you better videos <laughs> overall. So, and that... And that is, that is all. Mm -hmm. See you next week. Bye. 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 Thanks for joining us. If you like this video and you want to see more, subscribe to our channel. It's the best way to keep up to date with everything we do here at Board Game Coffee. But if you want to see more right now, we got plenty of videos to choose from. And if that's not enough, follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. I'm Mark Maya, and this is Board Game Coffee. And remember, have fun, keep gaming, be social. See you next week.